Okay, going to do a quick tutorial on how to find your iTunes folders using Finder in a Mac. Uh, first thing is uh, this is my default view in Finder. And uh, if you notice up here, I, I tend to like to use this particular view. Here's some of the other options, of course. Uh, but this will uh, actually help you see the progression of files as we go along uh, and open them. Uh, first thing is uh, you'll have to find your, your home folder, your home user folder. And mine is over here. Uh, if yours is not, uh, you can do a couple of things. The first thing you can do is uh, uh, push down Command, Shift, and H, and you will immediately jump to it. If it's not over here on the sidebar, then you'll probably see it more like this, show up like that. And I recommend that you go ahead and just take that over and drag it. You see a blue bar, don't put, not the screen dot, but the blue bar, and then just drop it in, and uh, it will show up. And then, of course, you can, you can arrange these any way you want. And I had mine down here at the bottom. Um, then you go ahead and click on them, and uh, uh, click on your home, and then you'll see all your, your files here. And, of course, you'll see the music folder, then go to iTunes iTunes Media, Music, and then your artist folders are over here. And uh, of course, you, uh, an artist can have multiple albums. Uh, in this case, there's only one. Uh, so you want to go ahead and highlight this. And uh, my flash drive has already uh, been inserted. So uh, all I need to do is uh, grab whatever I want and uh, drag it over. To that storage drive and drop it in. Of course I want it to go in this folder so that's why I see the green dot and, and just drop it in and, um, and it'll show up in your flash drive. So that's one way of doing it. If you want to email it, take two fingers and push down on your, uh, keep it on your mouse pad and uh, go into share and click mail. And as you can see, it'll show up as an attachment right away. You can send it to whoever you like. Uh, and of course, I'm not going to save that. But uh, again, go back into that menu, and you'll n notice that um, there are more options. Click more, and you can see here that you can pretty much use any one of these: Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, etc., and send it that way. Of course, you're going to have limits to the amount of things you can send through email or any of those uh, uh, media uh, formats. So anyway, uh, I think that covers it. So I hope that helps out.